You do not trust me. Well, well, well. <laughs> you lie to people and they believe you. Welcome back to Telling Lies. This game has taken such a dramatic turn with the drama that unfolded last episode. I can't wait to see what's going to happen next. I have my list of words to look up and I am ready to get into it. So let's look up gun and see what happens. Right or wrong, you are the guy holding the gun. What? What's happening? Is she... Who is she on the phone with and talking to him at the same time? Well, I've never killed anyone. What is happening? <laughs> How about uh, the time I lose my virginity? Hmm? It was summer. I was working in the courthouse to help my father out. He was a judge and kept everyone Is that in a order. Judge pun? <laughs> it's a court pun. It was a very hot summer in Paris, and everyone was a little crazy. I was this wearing is, this is all an act, one hundred percent, which my father said was inappropriate for the daytime. And that was when I met Max. Why is she talking to him on the phone and video chatting with him? I was attracted to him. He had thick crease, strong hands. With scars he said he got from knife fights. There was a cop trying to blackmail him. He got a lot of information on the first meeting. I <laughs> suggest I proposition the officer, so I did. I took him to a room and what? let him have me. Girl. Okay, that, that makes me sad. He <laughs> used his necktie to tie my hands. He smelled of So he turned you all the way out, Max. And she puffed a shape. And he fucked me like he was hungry for it. Your man Max was turned you all the way out. He done with the camera. Girl. He waited till the cop was finished. And then he jumped out. He threatened to show the video to my father and the cop stopped making trouble. And as a thank you, he let me keep the necktie. That is horrible. That is a horrible story. Horrible, the house. It makes me very sad. I've never told this story to I anyone don't you, though. before. I don't believe it. You better drink. You look thirsty. I think he is thirsty, bitch, <laughs> but not for a drink. <laughs> Girl, we started off this episode. Very interesting tea. Very interesting tea, girl. This gun. Hold on. We saw this one already. Probably learned from his dad. Mm. Yeah, he was a good student, but uh, we didn't really go. Yeah. Yeah, David learned from his movie people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, I need a beer. Do you want to drink? Oh, yeah. Kitchen. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, she likes him. Well, she brought him there, right? Now, that's the other agent, right? The one they clocked? I like him. All that Hollywood stuff is not. 
He seems like the kind of guy you'd want by your side with things down here. We should look at some bathroom. Come on. said to her. Good word to look up. Oh yeah? Yeah, you too. Oh, I'm living for this behind the scenes content. Right. Oh, two matches. Let's just watch the whole thing. Yeah, because that's what the gun and the badge are for. You really earned your wings that day. Oh. Didn't you? You got your gun off. You had your first blood. They really toasted you back at the field office for that one. Well, she's had it with him officially. Officially, bitch. The drama. Oh, she's mad as hell. Because I can. You waited in your car outside before you came in. I never told you that. But I want you to know that I knew. Ooh. Maybe we should look up car. Oh my god. That is so good. That was a good word to look up, guys. Let's look up car. I mean, I have other words on my list, but let's start with that. Okay. Just for things we haven't seen. I saw his car. Look, he doesn't have a beard. Outside, I went straight into the apartment. He was grabbing you, and I feared for your life. Oh, this must be the conversation she was just having. Off a fast forward and scrubbing. I love you. We're going to look up love, too. That's it. Okay. Handsome FBI agent sits outside in his car and watches over her That's while she's creepy. Very romantic. No, it's not. It's creepy as fuck. David doesn't know that Emma knows this, and she doesn't tell him. She just did. But you know, it does help her sleep at night. Guys, this is so good. She feels. She feels safe. So, one night, find out the real tea. after they go out for ice cream, 
Paul calls, says he wants to come over. And Emma tells him to come, thinking that David will scare Paul off, and that will be that. Girl, don't play games, girl. But when Paul turns up, David waits in the car. And when Emma goes to answer the door, Paul pushes his way in. He argues with her and he cries and he This is, I hope she's not telling the story to her daughter. And Emma gives him a hug because she's a nurse and that's what nurses do when men cry. You don't have to do that, girl. Fuck his anger. That's when David gets out of his car and comes into the apartment with his pistol drawn. And when he opens the door and he sees Paul and Emma, he doesn't look handsome anymore. He looks angry. Paul steps back. Guys, this is horrible. He looks scared. He's been psychotic from the get. Why would you marry a man like this? I don't understand. And David fires what? his pistol. What? And he shoots Paul no. in the what? lung. Oh my god, guys. I'm so glad we looked this word up. But what the fuck? There's someone sleeping upstairs in the attic. <laughs> so she's responsible for his death. But... So is he. It takes Paul about 10 minutes what? to die. Please don't be telling your daughter the story. Emma could have helped stop the bleeding and maybe he could have too. lived. But they didn't call an ambulance or nothing. David tells her not to. <gasps> oh, he's a straight up monster. It was unlikely that Paul would have made it. But you didn't even try. And sometimes David points out it's better just to let the bad guys die. And after watching a guy bleed out together, they get married. That helps make things make sense. Does it though? Even so, Emma is sure that she'll be scared of David forever and ever. I would be, bitch. That's terrifying. All right, Emma. Abuse. You abused the house. Mentally, emotionally. You waited because you wanted to save me. You wanted to be a fucking knight in shining armor. Horrible. He is horrible. How do you move past something like that? Oh my god. Horrible. Abusive. You look so small on the screen. This is terrifying. I'm captivated by the story. <laughs> captivated. I love you, David. But I'm not scared of you anymore. Oh, oh. Is that what it, I. It's too much. Goodbye. Oh. Paul. We gotta look up Paul. All right, after this, we're looking up Paul, bitch. I did wait in the car. This is it. Guys, this was good. I counted for five minutes because you were right. I wanted to save you. And He's on the boat, right? When the five minutes were up, I, I, I got out and I ran into that room and I'll, I'll never forget. Keep your tears for someone else, bitch, who believes you. I'll never forget your face. The way you looked, you looked more afraid of me than you did him, man. I've never been able to shake it. Oh. I don't feel bad for you. Not even a little bit. You're a dirty bitch. <sighs> Phony, fake, the house. I want Albert to grow up. Hold on, we gotta look up Paul. Think that I was a good man. Please. Even if you have to lie. And I, and I want you to know that you were loved. Is he gonna kill himself or are they gonna divorced? David wasn't a good man loving you. Oh. 
guys, this is intense. I had no idea it went this deep. I don't believe him. Crocodile tears. Wow. When this word car really opened up Pandora's box, bitch. Shock. I'm gonna do something. This weird music. Bitch. Guys, I'm sh Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my Jesus! God. Oh my fucking god. cat! <laughs> Guys, no! Oh my god! Heart attack! Heart attack! <laughs> I thought it was a baby crying. <laughs> Oh my god, I cannot. Okay, something came up. Nocturnal animals, the house. Look at the... Let's search. Alright, where is my... Let's see, search that. Let's see if it comes up. Okay, let's see what's... The... Animal logic? <laughs> can we play this mini game? Let's see. We can. I love cards, solitaire, and all of it. I'm gonna play this game. Don't read me for filth. I want to see if I get a trophy for it, honestly. Missing King. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, let's look for um Paul. 
I forgot what the guy she works with, his name. But let's find out. Okay, so the first three we can watch. But we both lied about Paul. This is crazy. That's Mama, I gotta go. That was a quick one. That was quick. Paul. Guys, this is so good. Yeah, well, Paul was a bad man. This is so intense, this episode. I can't even handle it. I want to know all the tea. It's only like a minute long, so. Okay. Um. No, no. No, it's fine. You, you know, you, you take care of Laura. Okay. Laura, who's Laura? Hold on, we're going to do Laura next. Paul. Huh. That's right. Hmm. He was always so polite. Always would hold the door open for her. I appreciate that. <sighs> she's always bringing home these she's boys in, she she's needs the hospital. And I tell dementia. you, every time there's something wrong with them, David seems dependable. He's handsome too. Reminds me of you when you were younger and wore those sharp suits. She's mildly disturbing. A little disturbing. Not because she has Would dementia, like because she's just a close talker. She <laughs> she's too close. She's too close. <laughs> Let's look up Laura. I don't think we've looked up Laura. That's Emma, is the wife. Nothing. Oh. oh. Let's try that again. Oh, okay, only one. This, this is the whole thing. Hey, Laura. Who is Laura? Did I forget something? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I, I heard. I heard you. You came to help my two girls, so I really appreciate that, Laura. This is the only other one we've watched. The other two. Yeah. Well. Okay. We have. We both have important jobs, Laura. That, Wait. That's Wait, our life. Is Laura mama? No, okay. he'd be calling her mama. Look, she's like, she's straightening out her neck. We can make this work. Who is Laura? What is the girlfriend's name? What is he doing? It's very bizarre. Who is Laura? Am I forgetting something? It's, it's David. Guys, if I, t I told you, I don't play this game every day, so if I forgot. No, I'm at work. That's the mother of Okay. I think. Okay. Let's see. What else? We looked up Paul. We looked up Gun. We looked up uh, Love. Did we look up Love? Let's look up Love. I don't think we looked up Love. Oh, I've, okay. I've probably looked it up already. Okay. Um. Hospital. Let's look up hospital. And then I think I will end this video. Okay. Oh, wait. All right. Um, question. Let's look up a question. Nope. Okay. 
asking too many questions, David. Most guys, they pop on, pop off. Yeah, he's, 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 a, there's a reason why he's on here talking to her. It's not fair. Okay, 50. He wants information from her. She's got a tattoo. He wants information from her. Okay. I was a ballet teacher. Um, I think she's another agent a and they're all in on it. I was a part of the Paris Opera Ballet. Do a pas de bourre, girl. Let's see if I you know what you're talking about. <laughs> Do a chasse, um, girl. <laughs> sugar plum in a nutcracker. And uh, lilac berry in... Oh, sorry. Those are too many questions. Sorry guys, that was my bad. I pressed the wrong button. And uh, Lilac Fairy in Sleeping Beauty. There's something going on with her. Not good enough. Let's, I'm gonna put dancer on the list. I know it would not be my vocation, so I uh, tried to become a teacher. Mm -hmm. Tip me again. And I tell you about the time the Bolshoi Ballet visit. And I finger bang the prima ballerina playing Giselle just to get inside oh, her head. Oh, it's like very, um, like very black swan. Mine. Very black swan. Oh, wait. Okay, very black swan shenanigans. Let me ask you another question. What? What? I'm going to look up Dancer next episode. Okay. Next time. Okay. I like asking questions. Oh. Let's say 75 for the first name. Ding. <laughs> that was fast. It's nice to meet you, David. All right, we saw this one. Okay. We have seen. I She's wearing a different outfit. Again. She's into the whole uh, you first. fantasy here. Tell me, how did you end up in such... Sorry, guys. An uh, exciting job. Okay, sure, but it's deeper with you. You are no ordinary Why cop. Is he telling her? What was the moment tea? when you decide you want this? I bet you were young. Hmm? She's definitely shady. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, tell me. We're going to watch her mug for the camera. Beautiful, stunning, gorgeous, darling. But the silences are too much. So we'll stop when we see some words. There's so much listening. So much, so much lip biting. <laughs> and do you want it to be this guy? What? No, it was. All right, we got like another minute and a half. <laughs> you are good. Oh, uh, well. I come from. I, I, I don't pay attention to the dates, but know, I should. Paris. My father was a judge. A powerful. She man. talked about this before, but this is. And this is the same when story. I was in school. I was 
sleeping with the guy. This is a different family. person she's telling the story to. Family. They were worried about a scandal. So my father sent me to America to study. And this is where I'm My husband. Sister. He worked in a bank, he made a lot of money. But he treated me badly. And so I told authorities about his insider trading. She gave him right up. I divorced him while he Girl. was in prison. But now I had no money oh, and I yeah. had no education. Well, she ratted so. him right out. It's a. No, she's a talking to world, him. Davey, but doing this, I get paid for it. And I can make men disappear like this with a butt. Which is quite disappear. We're gonna look something. up something. Not all the guys are like you, Debbie. Yeah, I cross my heart. Oh, look, Max. Here it says Max. That was my first boyfriend. The criminal. He did the tattoo himself. That's the third time. We gotta look at Max. It hurt. A lot. He did not need his name on me. You do not trust me. One of my regulars. No. You just turn up? Tip big. Bye. Okay, guys, we're going to end this episode here. So much tea has been spilt. There were some shady shenanigans going on. David, Emma, the whole thing. And I live for all this drama. I can't wait to see what happens next. I hope you can watch the next episodes. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video on this channel, please let me like and subscribe. And if you can, please consider supporting me on Patreon. Every little bit helps help this girl out. Thanks for watching, and I'll be back with more.